Hey guys, so today is day three of Vlogtober, so thanks for being here. Um, last night I went to Roller Derby Bingo, which was a lot of fun. I'll go ahead and put a little shortcut here so you could see where we ate. Ollie was there and he had a really good time. He's around here somewhere. Here is Roller Derby Bingo. It's outside of this amazing place called Coastal County Brewery. They actually have an inside, see right there? But look at how awesome this is. It's all lights, they have like this faux grass area. All these picnic tables, it is completely dog friendly. And the cute puppies. Ollie is around here somewhere, let's go see if we can find Ollie. There's Emma, where's Oliver? Right here. There's Ollie, Ollie is here, he's hanging out. He doesn't know what to think about all this because he doesn't normally go to places like this, but he's being a good boy. So they have candy for sale and over here we just bought our bingo cards. It all supports West Florida Roller Derby, so we're super excited to see if we can play some bingo and win something. But it is vlog style, so I'm going to show you what I actually I'm doing today. So this morning, well, actually this after, this morning I slept in. And then at one o'clock we filmed, Kristen and I filmed Let's Do Lunch. And then this afternoon I dropped mom off to bingo and decided to go to Hobby Lobby to pick up some fall, y'all, some fall stuff. Um, I know I have fall stuff out in the garage somewhere, but honestly, I haven't, um, I haven't even gone out there to look at it. So these bags right here are stuff I bought. I figured I'd let you see what I got and we could put up some fall stuff. So let's see what we got. The first thing I got was this awesome tray. Let's see. Everything is 40% off. Um, that's fall, uh, right now. So this was... $30.99. So I guess that made it like $17.99, but I do like it. It's kind of a rustic look, kind of. I have this tray over here, if you probably can't see it. I have this tray right here, but it kind of is not fall-like. It's and neither are the decor pieces on it, so it's gonna go. And there's stuff everywhere here, guys, because I've been doing videos, so. The next thing we got was this cute little pumpkin. A tag off, and it looks like this was $34.99. So 17, about 20 bucks for this. But it's pretty big size. Oh, I got this little pumpkin. It was $10, so that means $6. And that's just going right on the tray. I got this. Cute and has like the metal pieces on it. It hangs like this. Let's see, it was $24.99, so that means it's about $15. But I thought it was a pretty good size piece. So I think we're gonna just put it right there for the fall. What do y'all think? The thing I got was, look how cute this is, this fall blanket. It was $23.99, so about $14, I think. Um, what I didn't get was pillows. I really love decorative pillows, but I wasn't real happy with the choices that they had quite honestly. So I'm going to keep looking and hopefully I can find, you know, some pillows that I like. I could always go back. They did have a Buffalo plaid pillow that said, um, fall something. And I thought, yeah, that's cute. But you know, I do Buffalo plaid for Christmas. So I kind of didn't want to do Buffalo plaid for fall as well. But I did get this little throw blanket, so we're just gonna throw it over the cap. Next thing is cinnamon apple candle, right there. I love decorating for fall and for Christmas, but I'm terrible at decorating for the rest of the year. I mean, absolutely terrible about it. One of these days, my mom even said, we need to just have someone come and say, okay, here's our budget fix our house because it's very, very minimalist the rest of the year. And then during the holidays, I go like crazy. So let's smell it. Mmm, cinnamon apple. Next, I got this little sign. This one is actually gonna go onto the porch. This one was $13.99, so that's cheap. 
That was only like $9 for this one. The season to be thankful. And I do have a wreath out there, but I have a little wall that needs something. So um, my siding is blue. So I thought this would be pretty like against the blue. Look at these cute little pumpkins. I got a green one and an orange one and they light up on the inside. You probably can't see it very well, but they do light up. So I do like that. Okay, and these just go right over here on my TV stand. How cute these little pumpkins are. I'm gonna save this twine because I bet you I could use this for something. One of these days I would need it and says hello fall this was $5.99 dang that's cheap so that means it was less than four bucks and then I'm just gonna put this on the front here and actually I don't think this is going here look how cute this is and I got some sunflowers to put inside here it was $7.99 you can see that and we'll go ahead and Try to peel this thing off. Ah, oh, came off super easy. Love it. So we're gonna put, I'll show you the little plants that I'm gonna put in there, but this goes right here. But look how cute this is already looking with the little decor for the table. Then I'm gonna show you these. I just got these three little stems, or the little stem and then two sunflowers for this little vase. And then look how cute. Total little fall. Looks really cute for the table. So I gotta take the stickers off. And I gotta shape the flowers just a little bit, but they'll be so cute on there. Look how beautiful that is. Then I always like to get mom like special little um, dishcloths and stuff. So look how cute these are. So let's go ahead and open it for her. microfiber cloths. I didn't get any um, like dish towels, just didn't find any that I was like, ooh, those are the ones. Uh, but I like to have something in the kitchen. What I really want to find is like a cookie jar or something because we have um, Keurig um, coffee pods that I thought a cookie jar would be kind of perfect to hold the coffee pods. So we can um, put those if I can find one. But this weekend we're going to a farmer's market that's in our area. And so I'm hoping that some people have some fall decor, but I was really disappointed when I went to home, TJ, it's the TJ Maxx home store. It was all Christmas. All their Halloween was mostly gone. And the stuff that was left was kind of expensive and it was super picked over. I was disappointed. So anyways, look how cute. So you have purple and the dark red, the little fall ones, these are great. So mom will be happy about those because a little bit of, that's the green little pumpkin that lights up. Yep. Little pumpkin. There you go, it lights up and it's going right over here. And then what else do I have? Oh, I can't have a room without having a gnome. So this little cute gnome was $8.99, so about $5 for him. And he's going right over here with this cute display. Actually not sure why I got this. See, it's like all these little pumpkins and things. I thought about putting them around this tray, but let me show you the tray and I don't know that I need it. See the tray guys? I don't know, do I need little pumpkins and stuff? I kind of think it looks cute the way that it is. Obviously I got to fix up those flowers a little bit, but I think it's kind of cute. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do with these. I'll have to think about it. Um, I wish I had a little bowl or something. I could, you know, make a little fall platter thing that I could put like over there. So I still definitely need to get something for there. And I'm going to hang that one up there. But, you know, we have this and we have the little pumpkins up there. And this doesn't even pulled out any of our Halloween stuff that we have. That's going outside. And then there's a little pumpkin and there's a little pumpkin. Okay, so I still need some stuff. I'm still working on it, but it's a start. Um, it's only October 3rd. So, but I need to get this up and get it done. So 
I just love decorating for fall. I love the fall weather. I love everything about fall and then it leads right into Christmas. So what's not to love? I used to do super scary. Uh, when my kids were younger, we loved to do like the the Halloween, but I kind of gotten, I've gotten kind of gotten out of that now that uh, my kids are older. Now, if they have kids, we'll be back to scary and doing all of the crazy decor. But right now we kind of, we do the, like the harvest fall decor rather than the Halloween decor. What about you? Do you do that as well? All right, so that's it for today, guys. That's pretty much been my whole day and I hope you're having a great one. We'll have another video tomorrow. Make sure you go check out Ray and Nashville Flipper. You check out Kristen, a rural squirrel and Paul, Philly Flipper. And evidently dealing with Dalton is doing a short every single day during the month of October. So make sure you go check him out as well. Thanks everyone. Have a great day and happy fall y'all.